Hey guys, what is up? Dave here, coming back to you with another video for EMU Paradise. Last night I uploaded a video that I will now make private because I realized I made an error. Something I didn't know about or realize is that on Firefox there is an issue with downloading ROMs from EMU Paradise with the workaround script. ROMs can still be downloaded from EMU Paradise using this workaround. So for those who don't know how to do this, I'll do a quick tutorial right here right now, just really fast. Um, this is on Firefox. My previous video was on Google Chrome. If you go back in my video history, you'll find it uh, very easily. And I'm going to edit that title as well. Oh, no, never mind. thought uh, my girlfriend was home. I was wrong. Anyway, um, so on uh, Firefox, which I didn't make a video on Firefox before, you need Tamper Monkey or Grease Monkey. Uh, I use Tamper Monkey, Firefox Tamper Monkey, as you can see. Just go to add-ons, click add to Firefox, it'll add it to your Firefox, and you're good to go. From there, you need the script. So the script is very easy to get. There's several links everywhere. As you can see, I have it on my pastebin personally right here. Um, there's other places to get it too, like on Reddit. If you just Google for it, you'll find it, or I'll try to remember to put it in the video description, but no promises. So, uh, <laughs> yeah, um, as I noticed, uh, this is actually a, the original post, I believe, which was actually taken down for a short time, but now it's back up for some reason. If you use Firefox, simply clicking the link doesn't work. It just takes you to a page and it loops forever. You have to right click save link as then you can download the item from EMU Paradise. So that's the thing with Firefox. But if you want to install the script, you simply just need to find the link for it. Reddit, where'd you go? Click here, then you'll click install. If that doesn't work, which it didn't for me, if that doesn't work, copy all this source code, go to Tamper Monkey, go to dashboard, and oh click the plus sign sorry then just highlight everything paste it you're good to go now it works there are, is multiple versions of the script if you want to use the no jquery which is admittedly the better option um try this one out instead i'm gonna find mine file save there we go so now i'm using that one and from there, you, like I said, you just go to EMU Paradise, go to their ROMs, and I'll go to something random that I wanted to download anyway. Uh, I wanted a Dreamcast game, and I wanted Nintendo GameCube stuff anyway. So we're gonna go Dreamcast, and I wanted Burnout from here. Here's Point of Impact, simply click Download Links. If you don't want it all the way down here, there actually is a way to change this. So if you go in here and you go inspect element, you'll see class download link, target, it'll put that there. So if you look at the script, it looks for download link and then adds this to it. You can actually change that very easily. So I'm on here. Let's say I wanna put it right at the top of the page. I wanna put it like right here by driving and racing. Select that, look for the target name. Uh, you wanna find something that's target. Come on. It puts it here, so actually I'll do this. So as you can see, class download link, target blank, class, you want the class, I'm sorry. Or ID, I believe, ID. Holy shit, I'm sorry, my brain is kind of fuzzy because I worked all day. As you can see, it's looking for, in the document, it's looking for download link. So download link is what it's looking for, which is right here, it's the class. If you go all the way up and you wanna put it at the top of the page, the class is right here. Change it to, where the did you go? Go away, go away, go away. Oh, hold on. 
where it says download link, change this to genre label, click file, save. This is a good way to mass download from EMU Paradise. So now we're going to hard refresh the page and download using workaround script is right here. So simply click that link. If you're on Chrome, you can just click it and it'll start the download or right click, save link as, and you can download your game. So I'm going to get back into mass downloading from EMU Paradise. I don't have much space on my external hard drive though, but I did recently find a stack of DVDs, which is 4.7 gigs per DVD, which isn't much. But I also found another spare hard drive um, that has one terabyte of storage space, and I have my spare SSD that is just a piece of garbage that's only good for backups. So I'm going to start using those and I'll move a lot of the stuff off my external drive to um, these spare hard drives and because I have a toaster um, that I just plug my drives into and we'll get this stuff going. So that's how easy it is to download from EMU Paradise. Uh, for those who have been wondering, actually I'm going to move it so the link is even bigger. Uh, there's no class here. What the shit? Is there a class here? H1. No, it's just an H1. Who would have thunk? I could do this, maybe. Let's see what this does. Do -do -do. File save. And I'm just doing this to find the easiest place to put it, so it's still small if I put it there. I want it where this is. Actually, can't I just modify the script? Uh, like, H1, H1. Let's see if that works, because I want it to be huge. So it's easy to click, basically. There it is, download workaround script. Cool, so that's how you also make it bigger if you wanna make it bigger. But I'm going to private that video. I'm also going to fix the title on the old EMU Paradise, uh, whatchamacallit. And we're going to go from there. We're going to be able to download from EMU Paradise again. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I know it's a short one. Um, I'm getting back into Need for Speed Hot Pursuit 2010. So expect some race videos on that because I didn't realize how easy the game is. <laughs> and... Uh, some Seacrest Tour record attempts should be coming soon. So I'll talk to you guys in a future video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, peace out. Oh, and I'll let you guys this weekend know what's wrong with the Golf R. Might have a video for it, might not. Don't know yet. Talk to you later.